Okay, welcome back to recording. And now we can address questions or comments. I can go back to screen sharing if you'd like. So let me screen share. Um, and Uncle Frank, let me know what questions you have. Uh, let me actually, I got to get Nothing right now. Nothing right now. I mean, the okay. one before, but I guess your spiral idea takes care of that, the main question anyway. Okay, okay. Very good. So yeah, I mean, we've got collective superintelligence, the platform, all these systems and tools that I was talking about down here, all that constitutes the platform. Everything here that's in this big bracket from network of conversations on down, all of this is the platform. Just to review, fundamentally, it's a network of conversations. That is in, a, in three words, network of conversations. That's the platform. All the rest of this, the universal calendar, so you can have a map of those conversations, video conferencing, recording, transcription, all the way to bots. And there's a lot of dots here, dot, 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 a lot of features that we can keep adding on. What does all this help you do? It helps you find the conversations, right? All of that is the platform. All this green stuff, that's the platform. And on top of that platform, we leverage this whole platform. We leverage the whole network of conversations to develop strategy. The main strategies meet humanity's needs, meet the planet's needs save, heal, and transform human life on Earth, and save, heal, and transform life generally for the entire planet, for all of Mother Earth. But humans play a crucial, crucial role. We have become the main destroyers of life on Earth. We need to become the main healers of life on Earth. Uh, what Dr. Silas Rao calls Homo ahimsa, the, the species that is here to heal. Um, so that's the, that's the best strategy I can think of, or we have thought of so far, right? That's this part, that's strategy. Platform in green, strategy in yellow. And so CSI, collective superintelligence, really is the platform, including the community. Right. And that's why we put so much focus over here. How do we get people involved? Right. SRM is a centerpiece of the strategy. Food is a centerpiece of the strategy. The liberation of humanity is a centerpiece of the strategy. Right. The strategy and all of its components, that's the end. That's the goal. The green stuff is the means, the yellow is the ends. The green stuff is the means to the end, the yellow is the ends. Saving, healing, and transforming life on earth according to a specific strategy, a specific plan. The means include the technical, technical platform and the community, getting the people involved, right? Now, how do we get people involved? We need to give them choice. One thing that I'm finding is not working is just taking people and saying, hey, this is these are the priorities, got it? You need to follow this, this, and this, got it? No, people don't like to be told what to do. People like to discover what to do. So we have to give them choice. And also before people can listen to really good choices, they first need to be heard and that's where the press conference comes in, the press conference. We give everyone a voice. Everyone gets a crack at the microphone, right? And when they're heard, they feel respected. When they feel respected, they're ready now to respect others and listen to others. That's why this sequence is so important. The universal calendar is part of the platform. 
right? Feedback and improvements, that applies both to the platform, but also to the strategy, right? That's all of the above. We need feedback and improvements on the platform and the strategy that's evolving, that we're building using the platform. Same with new ideas, opening up to new ideas. We need new ideas in the realm of the strategy and we need new ideas in the realm of the platform, right? And party time is all about the people. Green equals means, means to the end. What's the end? Yellow, the yellow is the end. We need to feed everyone. We need to take care of humanity and all of humanity's needs. We need to take care of the planet, all the planet's needs, including cooling the planet, including feeding people only plant-based foods. Animal agriculture is destroying the planet. Right? So anyway, that's the spiral. That's the basis of the spiral. And then from there, we spiral and spiral and spiral and spiral. Round and round. We cover all those topics over and over and over and over and over and over and over again until we get it right, until we perfect it. That's the nature of the spiral. So that's it. Let me stop screen sharing and hear any feedback or thoughts you may have or questions. And Sister Ivy, feel free to ask questions also. You're on mute, Uncle Frank, you gotta unmute. I wanna make sure that I phrase the question properly. Okay. So it, um, I don't, I don't want people to be overwhelmed by the enormity of some of the, of the initiatives. Yeah, yeah. Well, can I address that or do, you, or do you have more to say about that? No, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, so here's what I have to say about that is, and this gets back to the press conference and allowing people to be heard Right. So imagine that at the press conference and in the whole network of conversations, there's a lot going on. Right. Think about all the different conversations and seminars and classes and research projects that are happening at a major university. There's a whole enormity there. Right. But the 18 year old freshman shows up with their backpack and their and their box lunch and they only plug in where it makes sense for them to plug in right? They, you know, may be an English late major and they just want to read books and read stories and read li good literature and write papers and be heard and present those papers and be heard. Fine, right? So the idea of the press conference is, and the universal calendar, think of the universal calendar as like the catalog of, of courses, at a university, you go through and you just zero in on what you want to plug into and you ignore everything else, right? So the universal calendar and the press conference are your vehicles, your main vehicles for not getting overwhelmed, but just zeroing in on what you want. See, at the press conference, you can go to the press conference and listen to a series of two minute or five minute little presentations and you can sleep through the ones that are boring to you or not relevant to you and really pay attention to the ones that are interesting and take notes and then go to the open house meetings on those topics that happen later. So at the press conference, it's kind of like this whole dog and pony show of all the different meetings that are happening, all the different, I call them open houses. Ideally, they're weekly open houses. 
So you present at the press conference for two minutes or five minutes, depending on how big a time slot you want. And you say, here's the big idea. This is what we're working on. If you're interested, come join us. We meet every Thursday, you know, from noon to two or whatever, <laughs> right? Join us. So that helps people. They can just kind of see the whole dog and pony show and just take notes as to what they want. And they can ignore everything else. They can go to the universal calendar. They can use the search tool and search for, if you just want to focus on SRM, just type in SRM and go there, no problem. You want to focus on big picture strategy, go to the strategy meetings and put your energy there. You want to work on the platform. Hey, I really want to help, you know, design the website for this. Okay, fine, go to that meeting, right? So you get to pick and choose. You're in the driver's seat. And you're on mute, Uncle Frank. I want to stay mostly on mute, Jamin. So that's fine. That's fine. I I, you know, the, the space bar is working now, so I'll just touch it when I want to say something. Perfect. 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 Does anyone have questions or comments? What did you, I think, was it on Tuesday or last week? You were talking with Los, El Los Angeles people. On the, uh, what is going to happen down there? Yeah. So um, there is ongoing work that Sister Ivy, who's here on this call right now, there's ongoing work that she is leading uh, bringing food to houseless camps, houseless communities. And what we're planning for Los Angeles is an expansion from the houseless camps to uh, parks where anyone and everyone can go with an initial focus on some after school programs and also the parks and recreation departments and their staff. So bringing food into the parks through a very specific point of entry, which is working with the parks and recreation department and saying, hey, where, where can we best serve you? Where can we help you, right? Including bringing food to you and your staff, right? How cool is that? And so that's kind of how we get in and, you know, not just their staff, but communities that they want to serve. So if they have an after school program, they want to attract kids, we say, hey, we'll bring the food for that too. So it's just kind of think of it like a wedge. We're wedging our way in, right? In a way that will help them the most. And then from there, we can expand. That's the idea. Because our goal is to feed everyone. And the parks are really a great opportunity for that because they're well designed, well organized, well maintained public spaces that because they're open air, they're safe, they're beautiful, they're relaxing, they're, it just provides a great context for pretty much anything. And the thing we're working on is feeding everyone, plant-based foods. So that's what we're focusing on in, in Los Angeles, going, expanding from the houseless communities. Thank you, Sister Ivy, for leading that to the parks. That's our big focus right now. More questions. You, you're, you're, you're muted, Uncle Frank. And that's okay. If you want to be muted, stay muted. I just want to. Oh, I muted. know, I know, I know. I don't, I don't know if you really need to keep saying that you want to feed everyone because do you realize how much of total human effort just in that area is devoted to raising crops and feeding everyone every day, the percentage of the total human effort. Yeah, so what, what I'm really saying is we want to offer food to everyone. So for example, you know, um, a, a dry not, cleaning, a, a dry cleaning service in Manhattan that says free dry cleaning for everyone 
they're not going to get they're not going to dry clean every shirt in Manhattan that needs dry cleaning. Other people are going to go elsewhere, but they're going to say, listen, let there not be a single shirt that goes uncleaned. Our doors are open. We're open 24 seven and we're here to clean any shirt that needs to be cleaned. The residents of Manhattan that are interested will show up, but it's but now clean shirts are available to everyone in Manhattan. That's just an example. Doesn't mean we're gonna feed every mouth in Los Angeles, but we're gonna make food available to every mouth in Los Angeles. The Los Angelinos that wanna continue shopping at Trader Joe's and cooking in their own you know, granite countertops and serving food on their own mahogany tables, they're gonna continue doing that and we're not gonna get in their way, <laughs> right? Um, but we're gonna make sure food is available to every Los Angelino. No, I think that's better phraseology right there is that you're going to offer food to everyone. Yeah, we're, we're going to make sure that everyone who wants food has food. That's it. We're going to guarantee food for everyone. We're not going to provide food for everyone. We're going to guarantee food for everyone. All right, that's already better. Yeah. I better start working, getting ready, because I've got to get some things done before I go out. So okay, I'll, I'll leave you with Alan and Sister Ivy. Perfect. Great to see you, Uncle Frank. Thanks for thanks for dropping in. I appreciate it. All right. Yeah. All right. Well, it's, it's been good. It's been good. Thank you. Thank you. We're making progress. All right. We'll see you soon. Sister Ivy, we are recording. Here, I'm going to pause recording in case you want to check in.